What is going on, uh, gamers? It's me, Cherry, once again with a, another Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl 2 official Aang Spotlight. And it's him. It's the Avatar. Let's get right into this video and just enjoy the wonderful content brought into us by Tafar and Game Mill Entertainment once again. Avatar Aang is back and ready for his return to Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl 2 with a fresh new <laughs> moveset face. and design totally fit for an okay. air master. With some returning movement options like his air scooter and glider, as well as the addition of another jump, Aang has excellent movement Triple jump and fantastic combo potential. As the Avatar and master cool. of all four elements, Aang naturally has other abilities at his disposal besides... So now he can use all of the elements unlike his previous besides iteration. Special pushes enemies back and lights them on fire, which does damage over time. Okay. His neutral special, Ice Shards, is a chargeable attack where, if in the air, he'll throw the shards diagonally. It's like needles. On the ground, they'll be tossed straight ahead. So he's got, like, chic needles his in a sense, but they definitely don't work the same, it seems. Devastating earthbending techniques. In addition to the powerful pillars of stone that erupt from the ground after landing with the aerial version, Aang can also spike opponents should you find the precise timing and spacing necessary with his staff. That was cool. Now let's take a quick look at Aang's light normal attacks. Here's his light up air. Nice. Down air. Back air. Forward air. And of course, neutral air. And now his grounded light down, forward, and up attacks. As you might have noticed, these are all entirely new moves from Nickelodeon All Star Brawl 1, and by extension, that means there's a lot of new possibilities to explore. Altogether, Aang has a very versatile moveset. God, and that's sick looking. To apply pressure and still make it back safely. His neutral game revolves around slipping and sliding with deceptive, elegant movements and generally defensive play. As you'd expect, his presence in the air is very. Yo. Powerful both in his ability to weave around a fight and to combo opponents. While he does have an excellent recovery, especially now that he can air dodge out of his That's pressure, good. he's also one of the lightest characters in the game, which makes him much easier to knock out. If you love having lots of unique movement and combo oh, the options, final maybe splat. Aang is the avatar for you. Thanks for watching, and stay tuned he really for him with the spotlights. <laughs> he really, um... He, Aang really hit him with the, boy, <laughs> what are those? He just put that with a fist and just knocked him out. That's awesome. But um, for this one, there is um, one other thing that I'll bring up. And I haven't really brought this up in the past for past spotlights. But um, oh, let me find it. Let me see if it shows up somewhere. Um, so I haven't been really talking about this, but Pancake Mix, one of the beta testers, um, actually is a player of this character during the beta. And I, it's a closed beta, so it's not like he can just show us, show us more gameplay or anything, but he can share us information on characters that have been released. And so he's been talking about, um, characters that his, uh, like Aang, for instance, so he is extremely... A, a big fan of the new kit and one of the most unruly characters in the game and he's a lot more fun to play against and genuinely has some cool things to do this time besides pressing nair and he's saying pretty much ask him anything about the moveset and so people have been asking him um so people are saying was that falcon punch at uh 18 seconds and that's a charged snare so ch charged uh strong nair People have been asking, we see a weird fl flaming kick in the spotlight. Is that strong or an aerial side special? Why is an air scooter the side special this time around? Aerial flames kick is his strong forward air, like was mentioned above. And the air scooter is down B, so that his flaming palm strike could be coming in as his side B. Does his down special function the same as NASB1? Not exactly, but somewhat. It's the same as, as far as speed and the hitbox on the ball, but when used in the air, it doesn't have the same little stall that it used to before. So it doesn't stall, but I mean, his recovery is better in other ways, so it's not like it's a complete nerf to the character. Um, you can only cancel needles with shield, so I my, my thought process with how it looked and functioned was correct. It is kind of just like Sheik Needles, but not exactly, um, in that it jump cancels only with shield. In the air, it... It fully stops the animation, but does not make you air dodge. Interesting. Um, can you still do the dive attack with the hang glider? Yes. So, so far, everything um, that we're getting at 
in uh, Naz 2 with Aang is reworked, except for, like, a few small things with his recovery. But even, like, his down special and up special are different, like, and have different reworks. So I think overall it's pretty cool. And I think that's all I've got for you today. So if you're watching this, the day it comes out, tonight we have Chum and Go 15, as well as a special event at 8.30 p.m. Central Time tonight with Thaddeus Cruz coming in to play against Do the Fig in a very special game called Duck Game. So if you're curious about what that is, make sure to watch that on my Twitch stream, Cherry uh, IPG on Twitch.tv. Uh, it'll be tonight at 8.30 p.m. roughly, um, but the tournament will also be going on simultaneously. So whether you're here for Nick Brawl tonight or you're here for just the general uh, Thaddeus Cruz gameplay, make sure to uh, uh, tune in for that if you're new to the stream but that's all i've got for you guys today um thanks for watching and i'll see you guys in the next video